What's good, YouTubers? This is King LA reporting in for Royalty Concepts TV sneaker reviews. Today we are doing the Nike LeBron 9 Mango. That's right, the Nike LeBron 9. Sounds weird even saying that, man. We on a LeBron 17 right now, but I pretty much got tired of buying all the. Right now, there isn't anything in the stores that that that's drawing me in right now. I'm pretty much tired with a lot of stuff that's been coming out lately. Everything looks repetitive. All of the shoes look similar. Uh, I like the PG4s, but I don't like the fit. They, they run like a whole size small. I like the Kyrie sits, but hard to wear that shoe because, again, they run a whole size small, so I have to get a 13 in those, which I don't feel like I should have to do. Um, LeBron 17s, I think I'm good on the LeBron 17s. I got enough colorways in that shoe. Uh, KDs, I don't care about no more. Kobe's, you know, you already know what the deal is with the Kobe's, so, you know, rest in peace Kobe, but it's like right now, man, the game is kind of, right now it's just a bunch of hype shoes that's on the shelf right now, man. Uh, it seems like all uh, the hype shoes are what's getting, like, attention right now, I want to say, as far as, like, what's being pushed in the stores, there's nothing, like, really different from the rest. And uh, I just got to a point where I was like, you know what? Let me just start going after some older models, bro. Like the models that like really said something back then. Let me get them out the box real quick. But here we go. Y'all remember these, right? The mangoes. Now this is a shoe. Design wise, colorway, comfort. Like, back when these came out, let me tell you something. I was in Miami. I had just moved back to Miami when these came out. And LeBron, let me see. LeBron came to Miami, I think, 2010, I think it was. I think it was 2010, and I think he dropped a LeBron 8 at the time. But the 9, let me tell you something. The 9 is what really took LeBron's brand of shoes off, bro. And everybody, when I tell you, everybody out here in Miami had these shits everybody and they they like they mama you seen chicks wearing them like everybody had lebron eyes bro and um i think i had three pair at the time i think i had the miami hurricane colorway i had the the kentucky and the black and red colorway and like the way this put like this the way people buy yeezys is how people were buying lebrons back then not at the price rate but i'm saying it's like as far as the 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 hype Behind the shoe, everybody was buying LeBron nines. The eights, the nines, even the tens. The tens were like flying off shelves, bro. It kind of slowed down with the elevens, but this is like prime time right here, bro. That black, that metallic silver, with the reflective Nike check and laces. And you got the mango speckles on the midsole. Air Max unit in the heel, and you had like a little zoom unit in the forefoot. But I picked these up, um, it's been about a week now. I picked these up last week on um, eBay for 100 bucks. Now, my only problem with this shoe is I can't fucking wear them. They're too small. So I, a size 12 in these is too small for me. And I don't remember them being that damn small because I had three pair. But for whatever reason, I don't know if it's because I've gotten older and my, maybe my feet have gotten bigger or some shit, but I can't fit them. I can't fucking fit them, so... I got to get rid of them. So, uh, uh, if you're interested, if you want to pair LeBron nines in mid condition, like the logos and shit is still like on the footbed. Let me show you. Perfect condition, man. I just can't fucking feel them, bro. Logo still on the footbed. Not dirty at all. Like the bottom is a little dirty from me trying them on but that's about it like no heel drag or nothing so if you want to pair lebron nines i would say if you wear a size 11 maybe 11 and a half this shoe is perfect original box just doesn't have the original paper that was like on the inside or whatever but yeah outside of that man i'll probably just see if i can find another pair in the size 13 i guess i have to get a size 13 in these 
But if you definitely want to turn heads, man, and take people back, this is the shoe. Just look at them shits, man. Look at that color blocking. Got that bright mango all over the place. Yeah, these, these, man, these take me back, man, to some good times I had. Those were some good times in Miami. I promise you, we had some good times that year. You had LeBron playing at the American Airlines Arena. The South Beach was always packed, man. You, I mean, literally, man, you'll walk down South Beach and everybody had on a pair of LeBron knives. You've seen people with the cannons, the, the Scarface, the Swing Man, the Dunk Mans, like, the Big Bangs. Like, this was the shoe back then. I can't wait till they retro these. But I'm hoping they change the last on these shits because, again, uh, I've seen a, a few other sneaker reviews on this shoe and everybody was saying the same shit. And I don't know why I didn't listen. But, uh, yeah, man, you literally got to get a size up in these. So if you're a 12, you need a 13. If you're an 11, you need a size 12. So, again, if you are interested, let me know. Go to my IG at KingAli underscore 82. Again, it's KingAli underscore 82. Send me a message, man, and we can work something out. Um, I'll probably let them go for 100 bucks, man, because they ain't really good condition. The sun want to come out and put some shine on these boys. Look at that shit, man. These look way better than the 17s. Way better than the 17s. But anyway, man, that's it. If you like the video, let me get that thumbs up. Uh, don't forget to comment. Leave a comment. Tell me what you guys feel about the LeBron 9s. And let me know how you feel about the LeBron 17. And how do you feel about LeBron's lines of shoes like moving forward? Or you think they're going to switch things up, man? Try to go back to more of an original look. Or they just go keep throwing flatted on everything. Or knit positive or whatever you want to call it. But again, I appreciate y'all watching. I'm up out of here. Peace.